Ah, you came. Eventually. Please, have a seat. I've only been waiting for... What, 18 minutes? I was not worried that you had stood me up. No, I am just a man who appreciates punctuality. <laughs> har, har. So the question is, am I overdressed or are you underdressed? Well, true, I suppose it does depend on the on the event. All right, let's call this a catch-up between two friends. Ah, okay, so the suit was indeed overkill. I see. Uh, my apologies, I'm, I'm not awfully well-versed in this. Uh, I, I, I haven't actually gone out for, for food with any friends before. I don't have many friends. Or any, uh, for that matter. Um, I have fellow academics. Uh, aside from that, I, I can't say that I uh, get out much. Well, yes, I suppose that a, a restaurant is a, a strange place to, uh, to meet with friends in hindsight, but... Um, well, I'm, uh, I read a book, you see, about uh, friends, not having many myself, um, and I found out that friends will socialise and meet at gatherings that can range from activities such as eating food, which is where this idea came from, to participating in sporting activities, uh, to attending fun events such as carnivals, uh, fun fairs, um, the movies, etc. Um, in all honesty, I am not particularly well versed in any sport. I'm not a very big fan of, of movies and that kind of, uh, of uh, digestion of literature. So this became the only... Um, the only... well, rational option, I suppose. I mean, don't get me wrong, I am... Uh, I'm a partaker of the occasional roller coaster so that may be an idea for the for the next outing that we attend together. I mean, of course, providing that you you, you would wish to attend another uh, socialising uh, event together, uh, is that perhaps something that I could take a, a temperature gauge on? Are you are you are you up for that, or is this perhaps this is fairly awkward? Um, yeah, yeah, I, I would understand if you don't want to do this again. Oh, you, you would. <clears throat> good, good. I mean, I mean, I mean, uh, yes, that is to be expected. After all, I am an exemplary conversationalist and very fun to talk to, and I am very knowledgeable in many interesting conversations, such as. <sighs> such as the, the weather and um, so what are you ordering this evening okay so do you have any any dietary requirements or is, or is this more of a preference you know some people are are gluten free or perhaps they, they are, are, are vegan or they are pescatarian uh, and others simply choose meals just based on personal preference. I find myself to be uh, a lover of, of pasta. So I'll be going for probably the ravioli. Oh, no, no, fair enough, fair enough. I suppose that uh, whatever floats your boat, as they say. <laughs> ah, yes. Hello, waiter. I would like to perhaps order drinks, if that's all right. My, my, my friend has just got here, so perhaps not food quite yet, as they're not very fast at reading. Um, <clears throat> but yes, could I please order the... Well, I'll go for the, for the red wine, if you don't mind. Could I go for the Saperave Kakete, the 2018 Caucasus Georgian wine, please? Oh no, just a, a, a medium glass, myself, thank you very much. 
and uh, for my friend here. Okay, that's an an interesting choice. Yes, that please. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you. Yeah, but bye, bye bye. Okay. Uh, well, yes, I suppose I had a very uh, specific wine choice, didn't I? Truth be told, I am somewhat of a wine connoisseur, if I do say so myself. <clears throat> Why are you laughing? What is so funny about that? Uh, I am not a wine nerd. That's not even a thing. Will you stop laughing? People are looking at us. No, I am not embarrassed. I... Fine. Well, the joke's on you. You have just lost out on the opportunity to learn something very interesting and educational, I might add, about the wine I was ordering. No, 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 the opportunity has passed. The metaphorical ship has sailed. You will have to live without the knowledge that could one day prove useful in an academic assessment or, well, in your case, perhaps the occasional pub quiz. I'm not being mean. I'm just... Oh, fine, I suppose I will tell you. The wine that I am ordering is from Georgia, the European country, not the state. And this particular brand of wine comes from a vineyard. They have grapevines that date back to the 17th century. Indeed, they have been producing wine from vines that are three and four hundred years old. And that's only the wines that can be, can be dated. There are some roots that are buried so deep that we couldn't possibly know the age of them without uprooting the entire vineyard. It's almost like you're tasting a piece of history. If somebody hadn't cared for the for the vines as immaculately as they had, if, if one day had passed without water or food or nourishment or sunshine, this bottle of wine may never have existed. There is something so fascinating about entities, living entities like these vines that have been working for us for hundreds of years. It makes you feel rather small, I find. Plus the wine's pretty tasty if I do say so myself. Mm. Ah, delightful. See, I told you I was a, a thrilling conversationalist. I mean, I don't know about you, but I'm having a pretty fantastic time so far. And, well, as for you, that smile hasn't left your face since you sat down. I can only assume that you are indeed impressed by my intellectual know-how. You're lucky that I'm not very good at spotting sarcasm. But I'm going to take you on your word for that. Hmm. But yes, I, I suppose this has been rather fun for me so far. It's, uh, it's not very often that I get to blow off some steam and, and hit the town, so to speak. Normally I'm always working in some capacity, and even whenever you and I meet, it's usually to well conduct our business. What about yourself? Are you perhaps having fun? Good. Good. Well, I would expect no no different after all. I mean, many people would be would be privileged if if not honored to be dining with an intellectual such as myself at, at my expense no less. So <laughs> There you have it. Well, 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 yes, I assumed that I would be the one paying. After all, uh, I did invite you out, and the book that I read 
stated that it is customary for the person who invites the other out has to has to pay. Come again? Uh, I'm, I'm not terribly sure that I, I follow. So me paying would make this seem like more of a of of, of a date. Well, well, I mean, I mean, that was was not my intention. I, I apologise profusely if I gave off that impression. No, no, this is purely meant to be a, a casual, jovial experience between between two two friends, two 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 colleagues, two, um, yeah, just platonic, entirely, entirely friendlike. Yeah. Just for conversation's sake. If this were a date, would you be horribly opposed to that? You, you wouldn't. Um, <clears throat> I, f f I mean, fantastic. Mm. Um, I, I, I see. Interesting. Very interesting. Yes, it's, it's, um, it's always a, a privilege to get to, uh, to have a glimpse into the inner workings of, of your mind. You are, after all, my academic nemesis, and it's nice to know that you would not be opposed to the idea of 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 going on a date with with me no no i'm 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 all right i'm i'm i'm, I'm not blushing i must have uh, must have got some wine on my on my face yes all of of my face all of it that must be it <clears throat> Oh, look, the waiter's here. Hello, waiter. Yes, could we please order? You're not, not a moment too soon. You're are actually, you've arrived just in time. Uh, by all means. Um, I would like to order the ravioli. And my part, uh, my, my friend here would like... There you have it. A rather interesting choice. They are just full of surprises, aren't they? Hmm. The the evening certainly won't be getting dull by any realm of the imagination. <clears throat> yes, thank you very much. Yes, thank you. Okay. You can you can go now. Okay, bye. Yeah. <sighs> yes, I'm perfectly all right. Thank you for 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 asking. I'm having quite a bit of fun, I'll be honest. I'm sorry if I'm weird. I, I don't really socialise very much, but um, thank you for agreeing to this. You're not quite as awful as I thought you were. Yes, that might indeed be the nicest thing I've ever said to you. So, cherish it. I don't give out compliments very often. Again, I wish I was so much better at sarcasm. Oh well, I'm sure you'll teach me. In time. It may take quite a while, I'll have you know. So, you'll have to be up to quite a few outings with me. You know, just to, to get that knowledge firmly drilled into my head. And I suppose we could even get started as soon as next weekend. I am very good at making a carbonara. Not to toot my own horn, of course, but uh, <laughs> toot toot. So perhaps you could come around to my apartment and I could show you the, the uh, books that I have been studying and you could perhaps quiz me on how to uh, understand 
sarcasm. Or you could just continue to tease me and hope that eventually it sinks in. Perhaps afterwards we could also maybe watch that new series that you were talking about on Crunchyroll. Form our first impressions of it together. Yeah. I'd like that too. 